Hi everyone, this is Felicia with FP Handmade. I'm coming at you with a very small haul video and then a little special something at the end. So first of all, um, for my haul part, I ordered me some art glitter glue. I got this from May May Made It's page. Um, she's on YouTube and she recommended this and she has a store now that carries this. This is the best glue around. It's the only adhesives I really use unless I'm um, using some foam tape or something of that nature. But this dries really quickly and uh, clear. And when you want something um, adhered together, this really keeps it adhered together. So I got some of that. And then I do also use um, score tape. Very rarely I use score tape, but I just happen to use up this size on a project not too long ago so I picked me up some um, more score tape and then from Tuesday morning I picked up this Echo Park die I mean um, stamp set it's uh, really cute a uh, little stamp set as kind of geared toward boys and I like the little bitty helicopter there um, I don't know what the name of this one is uh, just by Echo Park. Um, I don't see a name on it, but very cute. Tuesday morning. They had some um, alphabet rub ons. Um, I don't have too many rub ons. I don't use rub ons often, but I like these silver ones uh, for putting on cards, possibly. And so I got three packs of those to make sure that um, I could spell out the different words. And you can see they're only 49 cents. And um, they're by Paper House. And they have the little stick in there in case you can't find one of these specialty sticks. And, you know, those are hard to find. Wink, wink. And uh, as I said, they're 49 cents. And then from Not Too Shabby, I picked up these two stamps that have been uh, hauled by several people. And I've seen um, different projects being done with these and they are adorable. Uh, they've been out of stock on Simon Says Stamp and a other couple of stamp places that I tried. But luckily I was able to find them on Not Too Shabby. Um, unfortunately, the the dies were out of stock. And so I didn't get to pick those up just yet. But I hope to pick those up too, uh, pretty soon. And that was from Not Too Shabby. Right there is their card. And then I picked up a... Um, watercolor set. This is a traveling watercolor set, it said, but I thought it would be great for me because I'm a beginner at watercoloring. And I got this on Amazon uh, for no more than $10, I believe. And it just has the basic colors, red, green, black, brown, yellow, and then this really pretty gold. But look, it comes with a watercolor pen. And I'm not sure what this pen is for, but I'm going to try to figure it out. Um, I don't know, the directions are in another language, so, uh, or whatever this insert was, but it kind of shows you a picture of how to use the watercolor pen, but I don't know what that other pen is for, maybe blending? I'm not sure. So we'll see how that turns out. And that's all of my haul right now that I have, but for um, Mother's Day, I thought I'd have a little special drawing. Um, in remembrance of my mom who I lost around eight years ago and she's been on my mind all day as well as all the other moms that I know my sisters and um, aunts and everyone else so I want to wish everyone a happy Mother's Day and I have a small very small little giveaway all you have to do is comment below um, just tell me anything happy Mother's Day or what you're doing today how many kids you have or you know just whatever you'd like to say and then I'm gonna do the drawing um, tomorrow morning uh, right before I go to work maybe um, and uh, give out the uh, giveaway so I'm starting off with just these little tags that I got at Target they were in the clearance section and they're just some cute little tags and then also a little piece of trim from the Target section too and then I have this Studio G stamp that says miss you like crazy that kind of goes along with how I'm feeling about my mom today and then this stamp says, me is thinking of you. So, wow, both of those are kind of timely. 
And then I also have this rubber stamp by um, Hero Arts. It's a large phone clean back uh, rubber stamp that um, you can use on a card or whatever. I also have this, this little pack of flowers that I picked up at the um, Sacramento Scrapbooking Expo when it came to town. And then just some little cutouts from a piece of paper that I bought that I just thought was adorable and just wanted to share some of the cutouts from that paper. Um, but once again, all you have to do is comment below um, and indicate whatever you want to say. And I thank you for watching and I'll pull the name um, in the morning and post the video tomorrow with the winner and you'll get these few little items that I just want to share. So once again, happy Mother's Day and I hope you all have a great day. Bye-bye.